All right, so keep it on moving down here. Let's just let's just transition right on over. Houston Texans travel to New York to take on the New York Football Giants. Give me a player to sit and a player to start this week. After singing his praises two weeks ago, I'm going to tell you to sit Daniel Jones. <laughs> Daniel Jones, I get the lack of having receiver depth has finally caught up to them. Like people have kind of figured out the, the, the giants, their whole team basically stems from how well does Saquon play? Uh, if Saquon's having a good game, it's going to open up things for Daniel. But if he's not, you know, it's, it's going to make things rough on Daniel. The Houston Texans defense is actually better than what I kind of anticipated them to be. Um, they are they are probably they're probably two years away from being anything formidable, but they have a lot of really young pieces. I think Derek Stingley Jr. is going to be probably one of the best around. Well, by the time he kind of figures it all out, he's already a really good corner. So uh, they have a lot of really good pieces there. But I would say sit Daniel Jones this week. Um, you know, start. I will tell you day in and day out, Damian Pierce, just because that kid is now becoming everything that we kind of all thought he would be in the preseason. And again, if you, if you passed on him, you missed a great player just because I, I drafted him. So <laughs> catch yourself on the I mean, that automatically makes it oh, automatically makes him great. Cause I drafted him. <laughs> right. So yeah, I would tell you, you know, start Damian Pierce. I mean, because right now they don't have a lot for receivers. There are at least receivers that you've heard of besides, you know, you got Brandon Cooks and name me two other receivers on the Houston, Texas roster. I can name one, and that's Nico Collins. I can't tell you. And outside was. of that, I, can, <laughs> yeah. I, couldn't, I couldn't tell you anybody else on, on that roster. Yeah. Um, that running back so, for Texans has surprised me a lot this season. Yeah, you. It, he showed it in the preseason, though. Yeah. Like, this is, like, we kind of thought it would be that way. Definitely nailed the uh, uh, head on the hammer, the hammer on the head there. How you say it for checking out that man hour clip. If you're interested in the next video, click the link right here. Of course, subscribe right here and always join us Monday through Friday, 8 PM East coast time right here where you're watching this clip. And as always man, hour nation rise up.